with the conditioning of the body, patience and confidence are incorporated as a way of life, so that the individual may handle tough situations and tests of time in a definitive and decisive manner. With such positive messages to the mind, the Karataka eventually evolves into a highly enlightened and indomitable spirit. The spirit of an individual is the most impressive asset to any human being. The spirit is also the Karataka's most honorable entity. In Karatado, there are no limits. Age, build, strength, race, religion, creed or lifestyle. Karatado allows all to participate in unity. In a way, I think as a woman, it just also helps you to sort of get over some of the fear. It always starts off physically, but then, and that's what karate do really hits. It hits your spirit, makes you inculcate the same values as that of a warrior. Leaving it for the other day, um, you tend to look at it straight in the eye and say, okay, yes or no. There's no two ways about it. In karate, there's no two ways about it. Either I fight or either I just surrender, but there is no surrender. So then there is only one way in karate. It's always facing, facing the problem, facing the opponent, facing the opponent in the dojo, facing the problem in life. We bow before we fight, we bow after we fight, and at the end of it we go off and we shake hands. At least live with the fear and be able to walk down the lane in the evening without always being scared. A lot of inhibitions which we, had, which we grew up with, sort of suddenly we looked them in the face and I didn't even know that I had so many. And most importantly, they learn to overcome the fear of defeat and death. Karatado teaches to face tasks without thinking of winning or losing. That's what karate is all about. Never giving up, never giving in, and having that indomitable spirit. Hence all karateka seek to adopt the mindset of a warrior. However, rather than emphasizing on fighting, Karatado emphasizes on self-control, building high self-esteem, and boosting one's self-confidence. Through regular practice, the Karataka learn to discipline their minds so that they can function more efficiently in their daily activities. Team spirit developed by the Karateka is another benefit that provides a valuable lesson for all. Training is also a form of meditation which brings the mind and body together to create a peaceful entity in harmony with the universe. I need the Karate. I mean that I have too much energy physically because uh, uh, 
for the fitness and for the ability to travel and wake up early and walk in the village. First you control your, your, your body and so you are able to stand up and to speak to everybody. And, uh, I feel quieter, I'm able to stay and write on the computer and write a report. I have a lot of fun with the karate. I don't care about having one of the blue and, uh, and green uh, uh, and black belt, no? It's only, it's not for fun because it's a discipline also and I need discipline because I'm going everywhere, you know, and... Uh, <laughs> karate do cultivates the spirit so that its positive energy not only benefits the karateka but society as well. It has brought about a lot of confidence in the teachers. Basically, a martial art um, like karate, I never had until now, until very late in my life when as, uh, as being still a student myself as well as being director of the school. Uh, my eyes were opened. You're learning respect for those that you are working with. Um, also important for actors as with all sports, you're learning to be controlled uh, in what you're doing, to be graceful. Um, uh, so that you don't you hurt neither yourself nor those that you're working with in the process, um, which which was enlightening. You know, we all think that martial arts are is something to do with aggression and violence, but actually it teaches you so much more, which has nothing to do with aggression or violence, but but control and respect. It's a matter of learning not just the skills, but learning the whole way of life. It's a code of honor, and it's, it's, it is a way of life. It's not just something you do between 10 and 5 like any other kind of a job. It's, it becomes a part of your life, and it becomes the meaning of life, to, make, to enrich your life and, and to live in a, in a more fruitful, more meaningful, more correct and rewarding way. I found the girls, the women, thrive on that opportunity to be treated as equals and to, to be able to express themselves in a very overt, physical way. Um, it was great to see and I know they, they valued that. It is a martial art that creates positive energy through a disciplined and peaceful way of life. Karate Do inspires and inculcates tolerance and understanding amongst its practitioners and millions of people that they interact with in their daily lives. Look at the codes of karate. Yeah? These are bringing in universal values, character development, not personality development alone. You see, personality development follows because when you got good character, it becomes part of your personality. You see, karate gives the good people the confidence to implement the integrity. The JKAI Noida Dojo is an institution that has helped thousands of individuals incorporate the five JKA Dojo codes into their lives. Seek perfection of character. Be honest and faithful. Endeavor. Respect self and others. Refrain from violent behavior. It has produced numerous champions and international competitors. Karate Do is a way of life that will develop a better humanity for generations to come.